Mike Pence in the Bay Area today to help relaunch America's space plans. As KPI X5's Len Ramirez reports from Mountain View, his focus is on the NASA Ames Research Center. Well, Vice President Mike Pence signaled very strong support for America's return to space and even toured some of the facilities and the technology that will return Americans back to the moon. We're about to make even more history, and it'll pass right through NASA Ames and all of your incredible talent. Standing before a crowd of cheering NASA employees, the vice president said America's newest space efforts will shoot for the moon and even Mars, and he pledged President Trump's support and budget priorities to make it possible. We're going to send American astronauts on American rockets from American soil back into space. Mr. Pence spent the day at NASA Ames touring buildings and meeting the scientists who make up the Artemis mission to put a man and a woman on the surface of the moon by 2024. He watched as scientists ran tests at the ArcJet Complex, a specialized high energy wind tunnel that subjects spacecraft heat shields to temperatures as high as 14,000 degrees to simulate re-entry into Earth's atmosphere or even entry into the atmospheres of other planets like Mars. This is the place that we can verify that our heat shields are going to work. One former space shuttle astronaut said going back into space won't be easy, but... We have a lot more capability than we did then. We're going back. Pence says America will lead the way, but work with foreign and private sector business partners. Besides landing the first humans on the moon since 1972, Artemis will also help set up a permanent moon base that will support future missions to Mars. In Mountain View, Len Ramirez, KPIX 5.